Yo. Tell me why. Whitney's mill tank is coming through right now. About to have a rollout and sweep my whole team. Yo, what is going on guys? This is the JP3 Games and welcome to the finale. The finale of Pokemon Crystal Randomized Nuzlocke. This is episode 39, aka the finale. And if you guys missed the episode before this one, what are you guys doing here? Go check it out. If you guys are excited for today's episode, make sure you guys hit that like button down below and hit that subscribe button if you guys are new here. This is what you guys have been waiting for. This is what I have been waiting for. We are gonna go kill Red. Tackle Mount Silver. We are gonna beat the, I believe it's the highest level trainer in the Pokemon series. <clears throat> I don't know about the newer games. I haven't played a lot of them. But uh, to my knowledge, he's one of the most elite, and we are here to take him down in this finale. I went ahead and bumped everyone up to level 70, as you guys can see. So that's what we got. No one learned any new moves. Um, other than that, we're going to go ahead and go on into Mount Silver. We can get an encounter in here as well. So, I mean, we're going to see what's here. Um, let's go ahead and use Flash. Light this place up. I hope you guys are having a fantastic weekend. Whatever time you are watching this, I hope you guys are doing awesome right now. So we're going to use Flash. Light up Mount Silver. And we are going to mosey around in here. Collect some items. Another Mystic Water. We found quite a few of those in this Let's Play. Uh, a swine up, yo, a swine up, so cute. I'm just gonna catch it because we can catch it. I'm catching the swine up. Oh, uh, I forgot. Uh, that's probably gonna be the last Pokedex entry too, and I messed it up. Hmm. Uh. I'm getting excited. We're gonna name this the swine up cutie because he's so cute. Oh god, he's so cute. All right, let's keep on moving here. Um, let's grab this item. Might as well grab all the items we can. Ultra Ball. Yo, there's four alligators in here. That's, that's pretty sweet. Pretty sweet. Let's see what else is here. There's Ekans. It's a snick. Full heal. That'll come in handy. I think this is pretty straightforward. There's Nidoran in here. We never did find any Moonstones or anything. Um, I would have loved to have a Needle King or something like that. A Needle Queen. That would have been dope. HP up. Um, we can go ahead and take that HP up. Might as well use it. Um, let's toss out this Dragon Fang because we're not going to use it. Have no Dragon type moves. Same way with this uh, Metal Coat. We don't have any Steel type moves. We never got anything. We could evolve with a Thunderstone either. Da -na -na. Yeah, we'll just do that. Um, I would know... What does he lead off with? What does red lead off with? I don't know what red leads off with. But I'm going to say Donna is probably going to be our best bet because it's pretty much neutral to everything. Swanub. Alright. Um, we might as well get the items over here. There's Goldeen in this part. Miracle Seed. Oh, a Furret! Yo, where's Dobbs at, though? Goldeen. Goldeen, Goldeen. Goldeen, Goldeen. Oh, we just need... I'm gonna go get this item. I'm guessing that we need water. F oh, no. No, not out there. I just came up here to grab this item. A tiny mushroom. Um, let me see what's in here. I believe just an item. A mystery berry. You know what? I don't need the mystery berry. We'll, we'll let it continue to be a mystery. How about that? Catch me outside, how about that? Alright. I believe we just have a little bit longer. And we will be at red. As you guys can see on the layout, it looks beautiful with all 16 badges. It's a very nice aesthetic to have. So let's see what is over here. 
see if there's any more items we can get. Oh, looks like there's one. Uh, another tiny mushroom. There's a venonat. What is up here? Um, and another item. A leaf stone. We don't need a leaf stone. We didn't get anything we can evolve with a leaf stone either. So. Alright. That's the best thing um, about some of the new games. If you rain, you can randomize a lot of the evolutions. So you can change it to where if they had to be traded by a metal coat, basically all they would have to do is um, you just give it to them or you use it on them. All right, so we got red here. Let's see what is. Oh, victory bell. All right. So um, let me. Stand right here in front of him. <sighs> this is what we have been waiting for. The final battle of this series. Will our squad come through? Find out on the next episode of Dragon Ball Z. Psych, I'm just kidding. We're gonna do it right now. Here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, well, his Pokemon are going to be randomized, too. I just thought about that. I was like, yo, he's going to have a Pikachu, a Charizard, a Blastoise. They're going to be randomized. <laughs> Alright, what's he going to have out? A Spinarag. Yo, a spin level 81 Spinarag. Oh, my God. That's terrifying. Like... If, if you base level, like, a spin rack based off its level size, so if, like, a level 2 is, like, this big, you know, level 81's gotta be, like, freaking huge. Gotta have a massive spider. Alright. One Pokemon down. An Alakazam. I think I gotta stay out. This is gonna be tough. Alakazam is powerful. He is strong. Level 73. Um, I feel like I should go for strength. It's gonna use reflect. It's gonna boost its defense. Strength should still do a good amount because Alakazam does not have very good defense. As long as it does at least half, we should be all right. I'm gonna go ahead and use bite. Ooh, the psychic is gonna hurt. Mm, come on, eat that, eat it. Oh, thank God. And we will live one more attack to lose recover. Okay, okay, I see you pro plays out here. Pro plays. We use this bite and we should just be able to use strength and that would be enough. We should leave the psychic unless he gets a crit. Come on, don't get a crit. Do not get a crit. Come on. Oh. Alright, that was a close one. We don't want any deaths. Like, I'm trying to avoid losing any Pokemon if I can absolutely help it. If I gotta sack somebody, I gotta sack somebody. It is what it is. Alright, we got a Beedrill coming out. We are gonna switch out to Charlie. Alright. One Flamethrower should do it. We do outspeed, which is surprising. I guess Typhlosion is actually pretty fast. Look how slow that bar ticks down, though. That is insane. Alright, that's three Pokemon down. We're halfway there. We're halfway there. Yo. Tell me why. Whitney's Mill Tank is coming through right now. About to have a rollout and sweep my whole team. This is what I gotta do. I gotta go out to Volt. I gotta get a Thunder Wave off. So this bitch cannot use rollout. Fat little cow. Hitting it with that thunder wave. And hopefully it doesn't, it still has rollout. That is not okay. That is not okay. I'm just gonna go ahead and go for a drill peck and see what we can do damage wise. Cause mill tank is kinda fat. Oh my god, that is not new enough. 
We are not going to survive another rollout. Um, I gotta switch out to, um, who's got higher defense? Uh, we got 195 defense and 174 defense. So Suicune is going to have to come out to avoid the losing Zapdos. Yes, we get the Paralysis. Thank God. Um, I'm going to go ahead and take this opportunity to use Hyper Potions on Donna. That way we can get a safe switch in with her as well. And I might do the same for Zapdos. Heal Bell. Okay. Um, I'm going to go ahead and go for Waterfall. It's going to use a rollout again. Luckily, rollout is not super effective, so we should be able to live a couple. Um, this Heal Bell is probably going to come through. Nope. We are actually going to kill it right here. Thank God. Mill Tank was about to be a problem. I got scared there for a little bit. I thought the lock was going to end to a mill tank. A Flaffy. Flaffy's also a little dangerous, I'm not going to lie. Because I've got four Pokemon that are weak to electric types. Well, three that are weak and one is neutral. So we will come out here and we're going to hit it with a flamethrower to see what happens. Hopefully it doesn't paralyze us. It's a good thing it's in a full-blown Ampharos, because Ampharos is pretty powerful. Thunder Punch, yep, exactly. Paralysis, paralysis, paralysis. I knew it was going to happen. Yo, Thunder. Alright, we got the Flamethrower off. There's some scary moves coming out here. Trainer, Trainer Red has been, uh... And the last Pokemon is a Sun Kern. Set the controller down and say we did it. All right. After I click a couple times, we did it. We did it. We did it. Thank God we made it all the way through this game. We only lost once on episode five. Spoiler alert: If you haven't seen episode five and you're here, what are you doing? All right. 858 experience points and we defeated trainer red so he's just gonna disappear and there it goes the credits are gonna roll oh man it is I'm like so happy to have been able to complete all of Kanto and to do it with you guys on top of it I, I want to thank you guys so much for the support on this series it has been fantastic and I've been improving I can I even had people say you know from the beginning of the series to now like you know you're doing this better you're doing that better you know giving me advice here and there um, any kind of constructive criticism I always appreciate it I take everything with a grain of salt you know I understand where people are coming from some people like certain things some people don't you know I'm always trying to improve myself as a content creator as well so any help that you guys give me i do take into consideration i read every comment i usually try to reply to every comment as well um but i just want to thank you guys so much for everyone who's watched it everyone who supported me um make sure you guys go follow me on twitter so you guys know when the next nuzlocke is going to start because i've already got everything set up I'm just waiting for the um the rom itself to be completed and randomized and then i can start recording so with that um, we will have a Choose Your Starter episode, which will probably be sometime this week, and that's what we're going to roll with. But again, I want to thank you guys so much for the support on this series. I love you guys, and I will see you guys in the next one. Peace!